right, so just to start at the beginning, what is a dinosaur? How do we define them? Well, you know, I found that there's large-scale confusion over what is and isn't a dinosaur. And uh, a lot of times when I give talks, I, I, I give a little quiz and I put up a picture of a mosasaur, this big giant marine creature, and I ask, is that a dinosaur? And then I put up a picture of a, a pterosaur, a flying creature from the Mesozoic, is that a dinosaur? A crocodile, is that a dinosaur? And then I put up a picture of a little fuzzy penguin. <laughs> and the answers are, Mosasaurs, not dinosaurs. All the dinosaurs lived on land. A mosasaur is a marine reptile that lived along with the dinosaurs, but not a dinosaur. Pterosaurs, like pterodactyls that you see in all the children's books, not dinosaurs. Your children's books have lied to you. Oh no, they're <laughs> reptiles, right? They are reptiles. They're flying reptiles. And then crocodiles are the closest living relatives today to dinosaurs, but not dinosaurs. And that little fuzzy penguin, that is a dinosaur. Penguins are dinosaurs. All birds are dinosaurs and all birds are dinosaurs to the same degree that a T-Rex is a dinosaur, to a Stegosaurus is a dinosaur. That if, if you're a dinosaur that's a binary condition. You are one or you're not. And the reason that they're dinosaurs is they can trace their ancestry back to the very first dinosaur just like all the others. And if you have the very first dinosaur for an ancestor, you're a dinosaur. Wow. <laughs> all right. So penguins are dinosaurs. Penguins are dinosaurs. I love it. Yeah. <laughs>